Hello guys and welcome to Tech It. So last time on Crack Pack, like well, most of my friends at school said um they didn't want me to do Crack Pack and they didn't like it. So um but they recommended to do Tech It, which was like the old one of the oldest um mod packs there is. This was probably one of the first ones there was, other than Technic Pack, which is being taken down now. So technically See what I did there, see what I did there. Technically, um, this is the first one. So I've been playing it a while for now. I've got the Spax Pure BD crap craft texture pack for it. So I'll probably do a tutorial video for how to do it. Um next episode on this. So let's just play. So as you can see, I've made some factories and stuff, and this was like a survival one. This is my world one. So this is the one I've been playing recently, so look, that was the last time I played it. 12.08, which is like literally 4 minutes ago, so I was like 4 minutes ago. Right, it's create a brand new world. Um, okay. And I'll do YouTube is also uh, my head is working again, by the way. Figured out how to use it now. So there we go. Now I'm playing this on 1.2.5 because this is like the most recent update there is for it. It hasn't been updated in ages. Um, oh yeah. Also, I'm going to be doing a setup video in a bit because I've got my new computer screen. Now this screen is awesome. It is like one of the best screens I've had. So before I had the free screen setup, but now it's like different. I'm just gonna show you what I mean. Like it's one huge screen. See what I mean? This is probably really picking it up really badly, but that's what I mean about a huge screen. I'm having to put this on the other one. So basically I'm gonna do a setup video soon. Um talking about like how it's all gonna go. Wait, I don't even need this one in because I'm using the that the head that one the speakers so basically this is like a uh, headphone well. right so I'm in the world let's just open the map see what we are so we're in like basically now we're in um what is called a forest um over there there's some like a nice biome over there so on the spax is like connected textures so the glass connects the grass connects to the like other side like that and then also this happens with glass so glass isn't like separate they're all connected as well so spax is probably like the nicest texture pack in minecraft because it's not too real and it's not too like um default which is a really nice feature to the texture pack Right, so we're starting off in a brand new world. And of course, my nose starts to bleed as soon as I get a video going. Great. That's going to be edited out. Oh. Bloody fingers. Literally. Right, so let's just ignore my only other voice I'm speaking in now because I've got some tissue stuck on top of my nose. It'll go in a bit though. So, right, I'm guessing <coughs> that um, we should build somewhere around in this plains bio, maybe up there, because that's a, that's a really nice place to build up there. Yeah, let's go to build up there. I like that bit. All right, let's go. So now we've got eight planks, or eight um, logs, we've got 32 planks. We're going to craft and bench. And place it in the basement of this. Oh, cock. I made a hoe. No more. No more. There we go. Right, let's hoe this hoe. Let's hoe your hoe down there. One, two, three. 
axe. I'm gonna make a nice little axe for this. Right, okay. I think this is nearly gone now, so let's just pause the game. That is what is known as revolting. Nah, ma ma ma. Right, let's clean it up a bit now. Ah. See? Gone! That is how you get rid of nosebleeds. So it's not really a Minecraft video anymore, it's going to be a tutorial how to get rid of nosebleeds. There we go. Just like stick a bunch of tissue up, tissue up your nose. With a good old tissue from Aldi. Where I got my tissues from. <laughs> uh, I think we just broke some glass downstairs. That went well. Oh, this cove is so nice. I love this place. Like, this cove here. I mean, both of that, that looks pretty sick over there. But both of that, it's too high building. So, we've got the, this big build. I'm going to probably build all around here. This is nice. So, we can, like... Have like a bridge going across from like there to there, we can go down here and then like here and then like down here. We can make all this like mountain, um, this terrain our area. I'm speaking very technical today. Uh, what the hell's this? Oh, that's all coming up again. Yippee! Oh god, everything's popping up. I wish I hadn't touched that. Right, so let's just head up here and see what's up here. Okay then, we've got a bunch of like back terrain down here. Um, some pigs down there, I can see him. I can see his little back. Right. If you're wondering right, why are like the roses are like all white, most of them, is because it's moving, moving textures, it makes it all white and stuff. Even white in your inventory, you're losing it. It moves in your inventory when you've like picked it up, which makes perfect sense. Make some rose web with it. World's web. That's what I'm making. World's web. We can die. We can die that pig over there. Oh, 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 oh! Yes. I'm the best diver. Must that one. Come on. Oh, oh. There we go. Oh good, it's getting night time. Free. Crap, 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 crap. Oh, there's a pig haven down there. Right. So, bearing in mind it's getting night time, we're probably going to go, want to go... Let's go back down to that place where we were earlier. Like, when they first like found that the cool curve. That's what I'm going to call it, cool curve. There we go, this is down here, we're going to go back down. Oh god, Jesus. So I think what we do is for now we'll go down to that bit there and we'll just start like make a little hovel. Then we can start digging, which will be a good, good way to get started in this world. So if we just like dig this bit away. And then we can just like dig a little hole down here and block it off and then just start digging all the way through the night. Because the mini map shows like what time of day it is as well, so we don't have to have like um we don't have to have like a watch things. Bloody hell was that? Oh it was a bus, that's what it was. It was a bus. Right, shut that up. There we go. We're locked in now. Right, so you're gonna start digging and probably make a cool little mining base down here. Wait, I need to move in so the camera will be able to pick me up. I'm not really sure about this camera because, like, I'm not sure how wide it is. Like, I'm not sure if it goes, like, all the way out, like, this way, or if it's, like, really short range. So, 
I mean, I've had it for about a year now. Probably should know about by now. Uh, I'm not using this microphone because, like, it's really like quiet for some reason. It's really quiet. So whenever I'm talking with it, it'll be like whenever I upload a video on it with it, it's quiet as hell. Right, I probably should have found some coal before I did this. Luckily, like my bright brightness is really high, so I can like see stuff. You guys probably won't be able to see stuff, especially if you're on like a phone. Um, what might be a bit helpful is if I shut the blinds. No, that's opening them. There we go. Shut the blinds. Ah, double blinds with double the power. There we go. I can see a bit better now. This is the spirit of Minecraft digging. There's nothing better to do in it. It's really satisfying as well for some reason. I don't know why. It's just like finding all the cool laws. It's better to like um, dig when you're in a mob pack and there's more stuff to dig for. Like copper and tin and tungsten and stuff. And diamonds and nickelite. Fool's diamonds. Right, so. It's like really, 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 really dark down here. You guys probably will not be able to see an absolute thing. But, like, oh, we found our first ore. But we can't dig it up yet because we don't have the right tools for it. But when this pick breaks, we will, wait, I probably want to start digging out this little curve so we can like, plant and store stuff like get a little mining base going on so we'll just do this for now there we go I'm not just bleeding again okay. I'm like a nosebleed fanatic. It's all I ever get. I don't get ill or anything, I just get nosebleeds. Ridiculous. Oh. Oh god, jeez. Alright, stick it back up. Up you go, little fella. Ah. Uh. Uh. I look fabulous. I'm like a, I could be like a fashion person. What the hell? Why is there a blooming thingy on top of that? That is a red matter... What's it called? A red matter... Morning star. A red morning star. And why is it on my crafting bench? We've got pickups on this one as well. That's cool how it comes up with a like custom things. Right. So there we go. Now we've got a bit more of a betting, better mining mining tool. There we go, we got a new achievement. New ore miner. We've got some tin. Uh, pretty basic, pretty basic. Pretty easy to find as well. Copper is like the most easiest thing to find out of like, the new ores. Like, you find it every Everywhere. Oh god, I'm burping like a lot. Oh, excuse me. Right. So, see what I mean? Like, copper is really, really, really common. There. So, from like one vein of copper, we have got. Wait, one sec. We've got 20. 20 copper from one vein. Okay, there's, there's only one in that bit, but still, it's a lot. Oh, there's one more bit there. There. Let's come this bit in. There we go. Oh, iron. Mm. Our first brand new ore in Minecraft vanilla terms. Right. 
Okay then, so we're kind of going to need torches. Torche. Now we can spawn stuff in, but I this is going to be completely legit. I'm going to do this completely legit. And we're going to turn cheat mode onto recipe mode. There we go. So now all we can do is look at the recipes for other stuff. Which should stop me from cheating. Right. There is actually a way to make it go on to... Um, I only need to make it go surface map. Is this it? Nope. Wait. Then, then raise me map. Render type surface biome cave. Right. So if we put it on cave, and we can see where all the caves are. So like, you can see caves there and there. Right. So if we just dig down, and eventually, we'll spot a cave. For us to go into, and then we can start spelunking to just strip mining. I really don't like strip mining. It's so much easier to spelunk, especially in mod packs. Yeah, if you want to find diamonds, definitely strip mine. But it's got that. But if you want to, um, like, you know, like. Um, find all the ores like copper and tin, like ores that you don't usually find, like coal, which is what I need right now. It's better to go spelunking. We'll, hit, we'll get that tin a bit. Right. Oh, we found some some of this stuff. Now that is emerald. But I'm gonna dig straight now because like I can see some really good caves up ahead, up ahead. And they look like um, ravines. I'm yeah, probably gonna like, make another pickaxe now because I'm living out. We could get some light by doing this as well, so this is what I'm gonna do. Do that. And we're not going to make another stone one. No way. We've got some iron now. So, because we've got wood, we can just like, shove that iron in there and then brighten the whole place up. So, this is emerald. And um, it's as good as diamond, but this, this durability is good as diamond, but it doesn't mine as good as diamond. It's basically like pickaxe, but with better durability. So, it's good to dig, but it's not necessarily what you say, like what you use. Um, like to mine obsidian because you can't do that. Right, more iron. I want to get as much iron as possible because that's this is like the most, the best uh, material to dig with for now. There we go. Iron pick. Alright, let's just hoist some more of this in here and then do that. Whoa! Oh, crackers. Right, I need to get some stuff. Well, I think we've hit a small cave. <clears throat> ah. Get through. It is... Uh, okay. We are in a ravine now. Which doesn't seem to be showing up on the mini-map. Maybe I just read it wrong. Come on, up you go. Faster, please. I hate water. It's so slow. Right, go faster. No, right, just block it up. No, oh my god, it's made it worse. Crap. That is a rocky move. There, right, go. It's flooded like the entire area. Right, go away. Stop flooding my like entire base. Right, is there any coal? There's some coal, finally. Ages since we last found this. Get it. There we go. There we go. Nice. 
nice. Eight torches. Better than none. There we go. You guys probably be able to see some stuff now. That is probably just going to be like really bad for you guys to see if you don't have like a blind down or something. There we go. We we'll see. We can see stuff. Yes. It's not a pitch black hellhole anymore. More coal. Really, in normal, in vanilla, you don't need that much coal. But for us, 16 coal is not going to be enough to cut it. We need to get like about 10,000 trillion billion stacks. To be precise. So, yeah, we need a lot. Because, don't don't take that seriously. You don't need like 10 billion trillion stacks. Probably maybe about 20... 10, 10 to 20 stacks, which is a lot of coal. Now, there's something called a condenser in this, so that basically duplicates something. So you can duplicate anything that's pr that's in vanilla or some stuff that's been that's um like what's the word for it compatible with other mods. So say like thermal expansion, no, not thermal expansion mods are still coming right now. Um, Billcraft, some of the stuff that Billcraft works, like whatever Ruby's in. I think this is Billcraft as well. Oh god, this is back. Am I? So, Billcraft's one of them. You can transmute these. So, EMC is what you'd use. So, that's got an EMC. This is per one, per sapphire. It is 1024. EMC level, so if we had say one of them in it, like so one of them in the thingy, in the condenser, and then we get these, because we've only got one and it's the exact same EMC, the emeralds would give it, like, an up, given this another four diamond, uh, sapphires. So that's probably not the best explanation, but once we get the. Oh, excuse me. Once we get the ow, 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 I'm stabbing. Okay, just just ignore that. Once I get the condenser, then we can um, start condensing, and I'll show you in a bit more detail. Right? Do I have any food? No, I don't. Brilliant. Um, let's just turn cave off. Right, it's daytime, so I'm guessing we should go back up. I'm on normal difficulty as well. So. Right, let's take this back up. Oh, we can get this emerald as well now. There you go. There you go. Oh god, I'm at half a heart. Wait, what? Difficulty man. Normal, okay, looks good. Shit! Away. Go away now, people. Do not want to face my wrath. Two of them! This is unfair. Oh my god, yes. We are ninjas. And silent ninja. I can kill creepers with my brain. They're like hiding there. Bloody buggers. Oh god, there's probably going to be a bunch more like, stuff. That's probably worse than creeper. Right, it's nearly daytime. It, it is daytime, we just need to get out. Light. I can see the light. <laughs> wow. That is bright. Ah. Right. So I'm guessing from the bounty that we collected, um, we want to start um, smoking some of this stuff. Um, right, so first what we'll do is probably smelt up this, this, um, iron here. And I'm going to go make some nice tools out of my lovely emeralds that we collected. I'm going to make an emerald, um, sword. I forgot what it was called then. I'm going to make... Oh, wait. I'm going to make 
and then we'll pick and shovel and then and then we'll axe there we go cool right so now we've got that let's go over here and find them pigs that we saw earlier so we can go kill them and then get their lovely pork chops like um and then cook them up in a lovely in a lovely furnace like they're down here somewhere here's one right I feel like hunger bag I'll need at least three pork no, no well if they give me they're teasing me pork thank you they ain't given any pork. Nope. There we go, we got three porks. But this is as much as we can. Because I'm rather hungry. There we go, four pork chops. Five, six, even. Right, we're getting good now. There's cows over there. I could do a mistake. Let's go kill some Bessie. Pork's good, but um, steak's more tender. No, I like tender steak. Thank you. Oh, we've got some leather. I can make some iron now. Oh, I don't even need to. I've got like 15 iron. I can make some way better armor than just leather I make some leather chaps oh god no god <sighs> Ugh. there we go take these pigs now Right, we're on an absolute killing spree. Yes! Look, 17 sugar cane. Sugar reeds. Right. Oh no, Piggy, come back. Got 11. I think 11 pork and 5 raw beef will do. Because, um, yeah, that'll do easy enough. Brilliant. Right. I need to do a bit of sketchy maneuvering up this hill. And I can't, like, take a single hit of falling damage, so I'm going to play this um, safe. Here we go. Chickens! How the hell are the chickens going up here? They're chickens, they're not, they're not, like, birds. They're closest to birds in the game, so I guess I could give them that. But so now we are, like, right at the top. Oh, come on, it's getting night am again. That is bummery. Oh, wow, we're, like, right above it. Look at all that. Now, I'm just thinking... Can we land like a one block fall? I'm not sure, but I can see some two block down there. There we go. I just wanted to be safe, but I don't want to take, like, be really sketchy all the way getting up there, and when I jump back down, I die. That would be embarrassing. Right, so we got this, that, bish, bash, bosh, bob, shrunk, a funny, dranty. We're gonna plant up some torches now. Because I feel not, I feel like I'm not in the safest position outside in the wilderness. But that's probably enough torches for me to survive. Oh, lovely chicken. That tastes good. It's heaven inside a small little chicken leg. That's what it's called. Heaven and chicken chicken legs that's what I'm calling it so you can cook that steak up now and I'm just gonna eat a very cheeky raw pork chop 
because it's still it's still it's not gonna give you food poison or anything. It's tasty enough. So now we're gonna make some leather boots because they look absolutely gorgeous on me. With my lovely six pack there. Uh, we can get an iron chest plate and helmet. Oh. There we go. Now we're looking badass enough to go back down into that mine and reclaim the ores that have been trapped in down trapped down there for the past five months. Roughly. So I can put them in there. Right, just shovel, shovel piece of wood in there. The hoidies down the back. Oh, oh, there we go. So then, this seems to be in a good position to end the episode. Right. So I hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, leave a like and subscribe to the channel if you have not already. See that long one for the first episode. I'm probably going to try to um, keep these episodes for like. Probably, I'll probably do these videos more short, but for this episode, I only did it longer because we've got to get all started and get all the stuff we need. Wait, that must go on. So, I need to get all the stuff we needed, so like just to start the world and get going. So, probably next episode, I'm going to be doing mining, um, but I'm going to do a lot of off camera mining as well, so that will be better. Um, I don't want to spend like most of the time in the game mining, so probably what I'm gonna do next is get go mining and get like all the all I need. Um, yeah. So I hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, leave a like and subscribe if you have not already. Um, go check out the the um, tutorial for how to get back to your BD your BD craft. I'm not gonna put a link in the description. For the episode or the texture pack, I'm gonna put them um, the texture pack link in the um, the video for it. So yeah. Um, also, once I've done it, go check out the new setup video, um, which will be up soon, probably later on today. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next episode. Goodbye.